Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Lopez and today we're gonna draw different parts of an object in different ways in what we call stylization. Before you start your work you need four things. You need to uh, prepare your space, get your materials, make a playlist if you want to listen to music and set up some time. For this task, you will need your inspirational images, tracing paper, paper for your drawings, a pencil, and a pen. The first thing that you're gonna do is you're gonna try to observe your images and you're gonna try to find the ones that are more representative of your object or of your animal. Once you've realized which ones, uh, work better for your design, you're gonna trace them just uh, to get the main aspects of them. After that, you're gonna work uh, with them and you're gonna try to observe them even farther. You're gonna think, okay, so I started with uh, this parrot eye and I noticed that there was a lot of things, uh, a lot of uh, marks around the eye. So I wanted to enhance them to uh, show them even more. So I tried using spiky lines to make them, uh, to make the viewer look at them first. Uh, once I finished with that, I tried doing the same uh, part, the same uh, eye in a different way. So for the next one, I worked, I tried to keep the shape simpler instead of doing the whole uh, part around the eye I just did half of it and then I was thinking already how how am I gonna build this in 3d later on so I thought I need to connect the pupil to the outside of the eye so that's why I did a line in the middle you want to work with a lot of different parts of your object what I would suggest is try to do each of those parts at least three times in three different ways. That will you have a range of options when you're building them in 3D. After you've finished drawing them, you're gonna try to enhance some parts of them using a pen. So think about a uh, negative and positive space, think about contrast, think how can you uh, represent them in 3D a bit more. So maybe use some cross hatching techniques, maybe use add some uh, shadows to them so they uh, look more complete and it's easier to understand uh, how uh, their shape and their form. Okay, and that's it. Uh, thanks for watching, I hope this was useful to you.